There are no better words to start this vlog than by saying Dobby is a free elf now. Let me explain. So, on the beginning of October, I posted two videos. Those back in the times I was still doing videos in Polish and that was a daily vlog. So, I posted two videos. One was I'm looking for a job and the other one was called Frog. And I know that Frog makes no sense for people outside of Poland, but it's like name of the store that is basically 7-eleven but in Poland. So basically before we get to anything else I forgot to put on my glasses so I will do this now and then I'll explain you everything to little details just so you will understand what do I mean. Okay so today I quit my job. <claps> Woo! I can be partying! I can go do whatever I want, I can go skate, I can do videos or anything else and I am unemployed student. So welcome in the life of 21 year old unemployed student. Okay and now to be 100% serious and yes I'm saying that talking to a chopstick. I decided to quit my job because it is May, and at the end of May, basically uh, at 28th of May, at 6 something a.m. I still have some parts of microphone on my tongue. Um, I will leave Poland for a long time. Why, you can ask? Well, I'm going back to US. I'm going back to uh, Detroit, Michigan. I'm gonna be back at camp working with kids. And to do that, I need some time to finish my university. I have to do pass all of the exams and do all of the assignments, final projects and stuff. And I cannot do that by working 155 hours monthly and studying at the same time. So. I quit my job, but instead of partying and stuff, I'll be studying again. I just got a call from my friend from university that he wants to go to get some ice creams with me. And that means right now I'm putting on my shoes and I'm going to get ice cream. Let's go. The only thing I ate today is ice cream, four avocado toasts, and now I get ice cream. But I guess that's okay because it's the weather. Alright, so I was tutoring a girl from... Uh, I was tutoring a girl right now, that's all, you don't need to know the details. So I was tutoring her and now I'm gonna probably head outside with my friend from university. Uh, we're gonna be recording some uh, little short videos that I need for the other project. Uh, yeah, other than that, I don't think I need some more stuff. Yeah, I mean, I went out with my friend, we got some ice cream, we came back here. I mean, I came back here, he went home, he lives like 15 minutes from my place. And right now we're gonna head outside and see what we can do. Uh, it is... Okay, it is 4.40 p.m. Right? Wait. Yes, 4.38 right now. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna walk outside and see what is going on there. And I love this microphone. Like, I know it is a chopstick, but I love how it sounds. All right, so without chopstick. I was uh, on the riverside, I was recording. Uh, marketing videos for the project I'm doing right now and I came back home to leave the like tripod and stuff I grabbed my backpack with a laptop and I'm going back to Riverside to meet up with my friend to get a beer and to code sounds like a good plan all right so I wasn't cutting at all I just came back with fresh buns for my sandwiches because tomorrow at 6 a.m. I have to leave house because at 7 a.m. I have a train more about that later but I wasn't coding at all. We went, we got a drink, and we went to the dog park with a uh, dog of my friend. It was pretty cool, pretty nice. We got to know each other a bit more because, as I said before, she was my customer, and that's all I knew about her. So it was nice to meet each other, actually. So, 
right now I'm gonna get sandwiches for tomorrow and I'll get into the bed, fall asleep and see you in the morning. <laughs> So good morning everyone, it is um, 5.18 right now, I just got myself a breakfast, just as I showed you, I showed you all of those pure clips, and I'm gonna eat it, and we're heading out to the train, and I, yes, I still have wet hair, and I'm not gonna dry them probably, I just hope that I will not get sick. This view is amazing, like, look at this, wow, I am a big fan of it, and I like it very much, and probably I cut myself a hair right now, <laughs> I don't care. Oh, I am outside, I'm going to the tram, slash the bus, depending on what comes first, uh, it should be a bus in like 10 minutes, but I'm pretty sure tram will be faster, so I'll see what I'll catch. Uh, that's not my bus, so that's good. Um, so yeah, also I need to buy myself water, but the only store that can sell me water opens at 6, it is 5.40. So I'll buy it probably on the train station already. And I have no idea oh, why, but I feel like I forgot so many stuff because my bag is so light and there's probably the reason for it of like it is four days but I don't know. plant that I arrive here and we go to the gym first and then we go somewhere else uh, so yeah for now I have to find him because the problem is I broke out the word I have no idea is he already here or not just look at the city it looks amazing come on so David's car he is gonna be here in a second because he had to like go around Gdańsk is uh, weird about this part of like next to the main station, but overall it's well communicated and better than Wroclaw at any point. And he should be here in a second because there's like one light and he should be here. So I'm waiting. He's right here. So we arrived at David's place. He's behind the camera and 
we decided to go outside and walk around with some non-alcoholic beer. Uh, and later there will be also Christian coming here. So that's why non-alcoholic, because someone has to drive for him. Because he obviously cannot come with everyone else like normal person. He's like, yeah, I don't know why I come. And then he's like, wait till 6 p.m. Maybe I'll tell you, maybe not. And then he's like, yeah, I'll be at 11 p.m. And I'm like, okay, man, all right. So for now, we cannot do barbecue because we're waiting for him. We cannot drink alcohol because we're waiting for him. Um, so for now, we just walk around, have some fun, and we'll see whatever the day will give us because we're on the other side of the country. That's, that's cool. waiting for Xenon because he was meant to be here yesterday at 11 p.m. and then he at 7 p.m. called us that he's gonna be here today at 1 so it is 12.45 we're going to the train station to pick him up we're cruising hopefully he's gonna be there if not we'll kick his ass so let's just hope he's there I called Xenon and I'm like Okay, what is your train number? Because we want to find the platform we are supposed to go to pick you up. And his answer is Intercity. If you don't know, Intercity is a brand of trains that are in Poland, so... Thanks, that was very helpful.